My name is Brad Hall. I've got a really big show for you today. I'm gonna to be talking about the Yeezy 350 Glow in the Dark. It's an incredible shoe, so I'm covering that. And then later in the show, I'm gonna be talking about the best practices for getting the most out of that glow on the shoe. So stay tuned. It's a big show today. The glow in the dark part of this shoe, that is obviously the star, but that doesn't mean this shoe is a slouch at all when it's not dark. I really love this color that you've got here. It's so bright, it's so friendly. It just kind of lifts your spirits, puts a smile on your face, makes you feel good. And if a shoe can do that, that's a good shoe to me. Now it's not just one color. As you can see under this clear stripe, you've got almost kind of an orange or a peach color. Then look on that sole. You've got a little bit more Gatorade yellow going on down there. Now I do think this is the perfect shoe for summer. I can totally imagine throwing on a pair of shorts, putting on a shirt, putting on socks, and then putting on these shoes and going out side. We're at the most important part of this show. I'm gonna be sharing some tips to get the best glow out of this shoe. When I first got it, I immediately went to a dark place to see what this glow was like. And I have to say, I was fairly disappointed. It was still cool, but it wasn't what I was expecting. I thought this shoe would just light up. This was more midsole focused and kind of dull. So I went, I did some research. I figured out that to make this shoe work the best it can, it needs light first. You've got to expose it to sunlight or UV light. I left mine out on a roof during a sunny day that made a big difference, but not every day is sunny. So you do need some alternatives. One thing I figured out, you can get a UV flashlight. That's gonna charge it up too. And the nice thing about this, you can bring it with you. If you're out and about your shoes, they lose the charge. Throw this on it for five to 10 minutes. Then you're gonna be turning some heads. So it's a really nice thing to have. Very excited about that. I also plan on building a room where I can have some UV light on it at all times. So I'm gonna try to build that room just for these shoes. Now my other tip for getting the best glow, you've gotta be a place that's really, really dark. If it's partially dark, you're gonna see them glow, but it's not that really fantastic glow that just, just makes you feel magical. I found the best place to get a nice glow is a dark room, no lights at all, door closed, something like the bathroom. That seemed to be the best place to get that glow. So I'm definitely gonna be wearing my shoes in a dark bathroom. 